Because I think there's a, a definite way in which the whole kind of black struggle, which is very much linked to the American civil rights hmm. movement and so on, when you know the moment when James Brown or whoever the first one to say it, say it loud, I'm black and I'm proud. <laughs> I stood out alone, a culture unknown Learned to embrace diversity And I learned all about my own history In the 50s when I was a, a, a young black boy here uh, Riding through Southampton, going through Southampton You know, it was a, a strange upbringing You know, you're always your your difference was always known. Yeah. You know, as a young boy, I, mm. the one thing I hate and it still persuades me today, people used to it was always lucky to touch a black person's head. So they always that dialogue is key to perpetuating mutual understanding, no matter how hard that dialogue may seem. Every ripple makes a difference to the stream of change. The message also seems to be that we all have the power to bring about change, no matter how small the effort. We'll go on the same in this human game If James Brown would have quit Then we wouldn't have that soul in our music And if Motown didn't dream There'd be no Stevie Wonder or the Supremes I am Martin Luther King Cause he said I have a dream I am It's not that cool for young people to get into the race politics yeah. It's yeah. not cool yeah. I don't know why it's not cool because it's cool in our day Because it's too hot Because it's too hot It's not cool because we like it, that's why <laughs> Generally, because of the way I look, wherever I go, people make assumptions about where I'm from. So this lady came over to me and said, Do you know, I'm ever so, just out of the company, out of the blue, I'm ever so sorry about the, um, you know, about the Elgin Marbles. I mean, we just went, <laughs> <laughs> we just stole the I said to her, you know, I just need to tell you, the people who were stealing the Elgin Marbles at the time, yeah. there, I assure you, you have nothing to apologize about because the same people who were doing that there, they were screwing the working classes back like in this country, mm -hmm. yeah. whether they were white or black. And, and people need to see racism isn't something that's about alienating mm -hmm. part of the community. I am Martin Luther King. Tackling racism is what needs to be given a lead. And that would probably get the young people to follow. Because that experience of stop, being stopped and searched, um, you know, people are putting up with it in silence. Yeah, and, and the best way of driving that, I suspect, would be to make an issue of it.